what was the person that you thought you were going to be versus what you became as a result of not finishing this movie? Um, that's a tough one. I think I would think I was such a, I mean, if, you know, the 16-year-old self would have thought I was, you know, such a fucking loser for being so old and, and coming, coming to this so late. Because the 16-year-old self would not have imagined that I would have, you know, experienced those roadblocks uh, and that, that strange detour that circumstances had put me through. Um, and would have just imagined that things would have been, you know, perfectly not easy, but um, that I would have just been chugging along and just realizing my dreams and and not realizing that you know things do happen that are, you know, strange and. So the three of you really had no choice but to just pick up and move on. You you had no choice. Um, yeah, we we had no choice because it's you know the thing is when this 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 happens to you. Uh, this was in the place where, you know, a lot of people don't seem to remember that in the 90s. Um, you know, the, the internet didn't quite exist yet. It was really hard to look for um, somebody who, who vanished. Um, and, you know, basically three teenage girls trying to make a film with their friends who are all teenagers. Um, a strange film, we have to admit. And, um, you know, like, People, people would not weren't very sympathetic and would not have been very sympathetic to us. Um, you know, like just I don't know, like they, they, they. You know, when when this thing went missing, it it was just, we didn't have help. I mean, there was nobody we could go to for backup. Um, there was no proof. I mean, first of all, there was no proof. And and talking about this film, you know, as you know, you've just seen the images. There was no proof for decades. There was no way we could have proved, proven that you know we had captured something really special. We had shot in a hundred locations with over a hundred extras, and like you know that nobody had done anything like this before, and nobody quite understood the enormity of this. Like you know, like going into a school and grabbing kids and stealing old folks from the old folks' home and just <laughs> like hijacking buses to do this crazy thing. I mean, nobody outside of this little group understood or would believe that this ever happened. And then one of the, the greatest things, I mean, the heartbreak was having gone through that, having this thing taken away from us and nobody believing us, like, and then having to kind of reopen the wound and, and, and search for this guy and, and, and confront him and not finding him. I mean, like, people blame us for not looking harder, but they don't quite understand, like, what it is to have gone through so many levels of heartbreak. 